Good morning everyone as being a part of little teachers contest level 3 i have been selected for this and my topic is about heat so after completion of this topic you will come to understand what is heat what is the difference between temperature and heat and many others so what is difference between temperature and heat let us see temperature is defined as the degree or intensity of body to being hot it is measured in degree celsius Whereas heat is nothing but a quantity of being hot. For example, if you get fever, what happens? The energy, heat energy will produce inside and after that temperature will increase. Means you can understand that heat is a cause and temperature is an effect. So heat is measured in joules. And the next one is about properties of water. Generally, what are the properties of water? It is colorless, odorless and tasteless. Sometimes you can see that the water is somewhat tasty like salt or whatever. This is because you already know that the water is universal solvent. Because of this, it dissolves many solvents. So, if you boil this water and if you take it out, then the pure water is always colorless, odorless and tasteless. And the next one, so what is the freezing point of ice? Generally, the water can be in three states that is nothing but liquid, solid and gases. So, the water when it turns into um, solid state, then it is known as freezing point of water which is nothing but 0 degrees. The water starts melting at 0 degrees Celsius. And the next one is nothing but boiling point of water. It is nothing but when the water converts into vapor, the temperature where the water is converted into vapor, then it is called boiling, boiling point of water which is nothing but 100 degrees Celsius. And the next one, it is a general formula density is equal to mass by volume. So a big change is there in this formula. So let us see what is that. It is about anomalous expansion of water. Generally objects it get expanded when it heated. For example, if you take a puppet, if you keep an oil what happens? It get enlarges. But a different in water. Only when things become larger then it is called as expansion. When it is cooled it gets contracted. So it is different in water. What happens means take a, do a small activity, take a glass of water and keep it in the refrigerator. What happens? After 4 to 5 hours you take it out. Mark the level before. So you can see that the water level means the ice cube level increases. This is because the anomalous expansion of water. When the water is cool, then it compulsory enlarges its volume. As you already know, density is equal to mass by volume. As volume increases, density decreases. And density increases, volume in decreases. So because of that, there is a marine life. Because density is greater, density is lesser. So because of that, the water, the ice floats on water and water is down. So because of that, marine life is continuing down. And on the ice top, polar bees and many other animals are living. This is a great change in this anomalous expansion and it is very interesting. And the next one is uses of water. Generally, without water, there is no life. It is a basic need of all of us. So, it is used for drinking, food preparation, bathing, washing clothes, etc. So, water is named as universal solvent as it solves many other things, many other solvents. I hope you all understand and any queries you may ask. And thank you.